It's like Donald and Daisy are out here having a picnic in front of the Hollywood Brown Derby. Seems like a pretty good idea, but we didn't bring no picnic lunch, so maybe we should... Yeah, let's, let's go have dinner at the Hollywood Brown Derby. Maybe get a little Cobb salad. That's right. Bon appetit, Donald and Daisy. Bon appetit. That's where the Cobb salad was invented. The original Hollywood, not here. Hollywood Studio, Disney's MGM Studio. We so fancy, we even got a reservation today. That's right. See what this says right here. This building is inspired by Vine Street Brown Derby, originally built Hollywood, California, 1928. Let's go get our eats on. Oh, what's that? This first piece of paper is your adult beverages. Second piece of paper is your menu. See the band and it's like, that's what the stars in the report was from. So they got to the point where they were trying to avoid themselves and not be really seen. Wow, and this is where the stars would come to not be seen. Right. Very here cool. Here Hollywood Studios use it, and when we do get them, for privacy, we put them in here and close the blinds. Oh, wow. This is the story of how the was first created. It did have a bamboo roof. However, the one in California had sand floors. Oh, what? Sand floors? There was a... Uh, Sorry. Stick a look over to your left. Uh, that's where they used to have... An actual in the rest in the original ones they had a bar uh, for the lounge. Very cool. All the nooks and crannies here at Hollywood Studios on its birthday. Thank you, sir. You're what was your name again, sir? Stephen. Stephen. Thank you, Stephen. Appreciate you. Thank you. See you. The original bamboo room, the Hollywood Brown Derby's first cocktail lounge, opened on February 6, 1936, from palm trees and bamboo chairs to exotic zebra prints and a faux sand floor, the bamboo room possessed a distinct tropical theme. The South Seas influence was popular in Hollywood restaurants and nightclubs through the 20s and 30s. There it is. The bamboo room. Fancy. All right, look like Amy got her an alcoholic beverage for her birthday. What you got there? Some sort of peach. Fruity concoction? Yes. Oh, that's right. Sam said I could have her cherry. <laughs> Right, looks like we got some bread service here. Yum. Ooh. Even the butter's fancy around these parts. Well, the shrimp mac and cheese is an appetizer for our Cobb salads come to town. Let's see what's good. Side of a little pot there, and there's a shrimp and mac and cheese. Mm. 
All right, dinner has arrived. We got the world famous Cobb salad, which, according to the uh, story, was created right here, excuse me, at the original Brown Derby in California. We are in a reproduction of such things in Hollywood Studios for their 34th birthday. <laughs> but it, what'd you put, what you do to the shenanigans that's going on here? Tell me now, tell me, what are you doing? I don't want the avocado. She don't want no avocado. She wouldn't eat the... Lord, Lord, well, I guess of all the things, Avocado, I can deal with. Additionally, more agua. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Amy. Amy. Happy birthday to you. Yay. All right, that's a wrap on the Brown Derby. Thank you, there, Sammy Davis Jr. Yeah, that's right, Cat. That's okay. The candy man can. All right, I think I might have uh, come across a little hidden gem here. This looks like this is the entrance to Club 33. I didn't even know they had one of these here at Disney's Hollywood Studios. Well, you just learned a nooks and cranny with Mr. Nooks and Cranny. Oh, so sweet. Oh, they're dancing. <laughs>